Hey guys, this is Miss Hazemeyer. Want to talk to you about one of my favorite classic novels. This is Of My Sin Men by John Steinbeck. And I love this book for so many reasons. Um, first, let's just talk a little bit about the characters. So the story revolves around two main characters, George and Lenny. Um, George and Lenny are two Bindlestiffs in the 1930s, which means that they are drifters. They are hobos. They are traveling from place to place looking for work. Because as you know, in the 1930s, um, our country was going through the Great Depression. So there was, you know, there was no money. There were little jobs. And so it was just a hard time for everyone. So George and Lenny are traveling from farm to farm and they are doing uh, manual labor and working in like the hay fields and they're bucking barley and, and they are living the, um, the sort of migrant farmer life. And so George and Lenny travel from farm to farm and it seems like everywhere they go, Lenny always seems to get into trouble. Um, now you have to understand that Lenny's character, um, he... Um, you know, Lenny's character, he has a mental disability and so George is sort of his caretaker and so Lenny, you know, has a huge heart and is just a sweet, sweet character, but he's very big and very strong and doesn't really know his own strength. And so George is, is there to kind of keep him in line and help take care of him. So they're traveling from farm to farm, um, and they end up at a ranch, um, in Salinas, California. And so... They, um, you know, immediately make friends with other guys there on the farm, but there's um, one guy on the farm who is particularly hard to get along with, and that's the boss's son. His name is um, Curly, and Curly is a boxer. He's this little guy, and Curly is just really hot-headed, and he just can't stand big guys because he's a little guy, and so... Um, Curly immediately sizes Lenny up as soon as they arrive. And so, you know, and Lenny not really understanding what's going on, you know, he just kind of lives in his own little world. Um, and his world is filled with the idea of George and him getting this farm where they can have lots of rabbits. And, um, he wants to tend the rabbits and he talks about that all the time. So, um, it's just a great story. There's, there's action, um, you know, there it's it's sad, but at the same time, you know, it's this it's this story of George really just taking care of Lenny and Lenny being just a big hearted guy. So um the end is completely shocking. Um I was not expecting it at all. And when you read it um for the first time, you're just gonna kind of turn the last page and be like, what just happened? Um, but it is a great, great story. So I highly recommend that you check out and read of Mice and Men by John Steinbeck. Tiny little book. I know that's always something that everybody looks at when they go to check out a book. Um, and But just an amazing, amazing story. So um, please check it out. One of my faves.